Okay, where were we? Uh, also... Some new gadgets available in my shop for testing. I, I mean for purchase. They're totally safe. Not available to enter. Well, at least he's been obviously. found. Yeah, but he's brainless. I guess that didn't really do anything. Um, just getting this money really quick. Anyway, hi, how y'all been? Uh, let's switch back to levitation. Oh, I didn't see that till just now. Intern Aquato, you now have brain tumbler delousing duties. But first, please come to class. Okay, fine. Where's the classroom? Just okay, well, we have interesting clairvoyance things. Bacon. Okay. Whoa. Um. So is, uh, what's his name? Hey, don't worry. We're going to find Nick's brain. It's just... He was so... So great at sorting mail, you know? I'll sort your mail, Colin. What? I'm sorry. I don't know what I'm saying. Uh, okay. I'm gonna... Check out... Okay, yeah, you're in love. You see me as a... Cigarette vending machine with a face on the bot. Okay. Huh? Okay. Don't be a psy bore. Get yourself a psy core. Welcome back. Good to see you again. Can we buy any pins? We can not really. Well, we don't even have the brain block upgrade, so that doesn't help us right now. You know what? Good selection. Worth it. Come back anytime. Anyway, let's uh oh. Damn it. I keep forgetting how to switch that. Let's uh go oh, to the classroom. Good. You're finally here. Let me know when you're prepared to learn something. Uh <clears throat> Um Yeah. Sure. If I may speak. You may not. Class is in session. When does class start? As soon as you get to my classroom. This isn't your classroom? No. This is. So are you ready, kid? Okay, sure. Yeah. And what are you ready for? Safety. Oh, you think the human mind is safe? Well, that's cute. I just realized my microphone was not in the correct setting. It has been fixed. Hi. Luckily, I didn't go through an entire episode with it like that. That was cool. Ew. Why are you thinking about cilantro? Like, I like cilantro. I don't know why I said you, but I guess... And that is how you perform the advanced psychic ability known as mental connection. Cool. Ooh, sorry. Could you repeat that? Sorry, kid. I warned you not to be late. I'm off to attend to some fiduciary concerns. Norma, take over for me, won't you? You can practice with some of those loose ideas. But Agent Forsythe, is it safe to leave all these thoughts out like this if you're not here? Norma, please. It takes more than a few rambunctious children to affect the mind of a trained psychonaut. Uh, what are you doing, weirdo? 
Yeah, what are you doing, Raz? Try not to fall asleep in my class. All right, Repscallion. Okay, now how do I explain mental connection extremely simply? Let me guess. We focus on an idea in someone's mind until we form a tangible connection with it. Oh, I didn't realize you were a mental connection expert. By all means, give us a demo. Professor. Uh oh. I don't think we're gonna need that anytime soon, so if you can <gasps> What the heck did you just do? I said connect with the idea, not jump inside it like a hamster ball. Sorry. Old habit from the circus, I guess. Connect other things. Not only is cilantro delicious, it's affordable and easy to grow in a window box herb garden. What the heck is that? What? You left a slime trail. It's like he connected the two thoughts together. Oh, now you're in trouble. Hey, what's the big idea? Looks like... Disgust. Well, I'm sure it's not the first time Rasputin has created that thought in someone's mind. So we're going to be able to affect people's personalities and stuff. Is this I know cilantro reduces the risk of digestive distress, but it tastes like soap. And honestly, I'd rather have the gas. Hey, Raz. If you can change Forsyth's opinion of cilantro, maybe you could change her mind about the casino mission. Hmm, I don't know about that. Yeah, I mean, she worries about us kids too much. It's taking years off of her life expectancy. Hmm, if you could get her not to be so worried all the time, we could all go on a real Psychonauts mission! Well, I don't suppose it would hurt to take a look around up there. Just see if there's any, you know, problems. Raz, stop. I know you want to fit in, but oh god. Honey, please understand. Stop, stop Raz. Of course, if you're well, scared. What's this little do system doing here? I mean, you'll probably get kicked out of the Psychonauts for trying, but what the heck? Connect those thoughts, young man! Try not to kill her brain, Raz. Remember, it's for the good of the mission. I'm gonna collect these figments really quick. Here's the steamer trunk tag. All right. So what if I do this? Cilantro delicious, it's affordable and easy to grow. With. Not only is cilantro delicious, it's affordable. Oh crap, I can't. Uh... Oh, not only is cilantro delicious, it's affordable. I know cilantro reduces the risk of digestive distress, but it tastes like soap. And honestly, I'd rather have the gas. All right, got it on one. Oh, wait. This was a terrible idea. Yes, it was, Raz. Why are you doing this? These you... Kids. They just don't have the experience. I'll just have to get Sasha to give up half of his laboratory budget. It was hard enough getting him to give up wearing socks with sandals, but you did it, Forsyth. Remember that. <sighs> 
Need to cut out the frills in the cafeteria for sure. No more imported truffles, Otto. Regular mushrooms are just as good. What am I, I supposed to do here? I hear Mia complaining she can't meditate without fresh cilantro in her chimichurri. That stuff tastes like soap for Dello. And also, we can't afford it. Oh. What? What? If I let them go to that casino, that's it. They'd be dead. Okay, so she is genuinely worried. I'm not letting another agent get hurt on my watch. Okay, so she is actually I worried. No, I'm here. I need to keep them safe. Without funding, how can I keep anyone safe? Yeah, this was a bad. Ah! Ah! Our Lady of Restraint Neurological Hospital. I think Hollis said she was an intern here once. I always had my best ideas here. Let's just hope I don't run into Dr. Putz. Maybe trying to change her mind is a bad idea. Oh, fuck. No, wait. I think that is a bad idea. Okay, cool. No room in here for any bad ideas but my own. Speaking of, I gotta catch up to Hollis and try to change her mind about the mission. No, you shouldn't. This was a bad idea. You just said that. You literally should not do that, dude. I see another nugget of wisdom. I will also take this health. And this health, I guess. We got figments around, so I'll grab those. Oh, hey, there's a... The bag. I think I already have the tag for that one, unless that's the duffel bag. I don't actually know what... I know what a steamer trunk is, so this is not the steamer trunk. It's a hat box? I thought that was a duffel bag. I don't know. I had a duffel bag that was vertical and not horizontal. I don't fucking know. Oh, there's the hat box tag. Ah, here's the hat box tag. I think I hear some. Uh, steamer trunk. Yeah, that's a steamer trunk. Alright, and then we need to go do the hat box. <laughs> Dope. Okay. Uh, is there anywhere else we have to do down here? No? Doesn't look like it. Okay. Raz, how are you grabbing that? Just checking to see if there's anything. No, it doesn't look like it. Uh, okay. Hi ho, hi ho, into the hospital we go. Oh my god, look at the size of that kid's head! Get him to radiology, stat! Just got a big head. Oh, what the fuck? I didn't even see Raz down in the corner there. You saved another life, Dr. Potts. 
Oh, please. I was just doing my job. I heard the technique you used was developed by your intern, Hollis Forsyth. Oh, uh, my intern? <laughs> yes, yes, well, we did collaborate on that a little. The patient okay. will make a full recovery, Dr. Potts. All thanks to you. Mm-hmm. And your brilliant intern, Hollis Forsyth. Why, uh, yes. Well, oh, she has been a helpful assistant. Ah, so yes, he is a piece of shit. I like the look of these. This brain has made amazing progress. Another life saved by the Forsyth method. The, the POTS method? POTS? It was my invention? That in turn merely transcribed my dictation. Oh, uh, my apologies, Dr. Potts. In fact, I was thinking of getting rid of her. Uh-huh. Well, first off, what the fuck are you? Hey, I got half of mine. Oh, that's... That's really good. I've got half a mind to look for the other half. Something tells me it's not too far away. That's real dumb. I like that. Okay, let's grab these figments really quick. Wait, is that a figment? It is. Okay. Um... Oh. I can't believe some people prefer open casket funerals. Disgusting. Ah, Whoops. Good luck collecting your debts after I'm dead, losers. Okay. The platforming feels so fucking good. I can't believe some people prefer open casket funerals. Hmm. Disgusting. At our current burn rate. Oh, that's no good. Maybe if I move some funds around. I could postpone paying those bills, but not these. Oh, okay. off the table for sure bet the gastronauts don't have to pinch pennies like this Where food the money for that what if i eliminate some meals i could cut my own paycheck for a while oh. i i want a gastronauts game I went next to school for medicine how did i end up stressing about money management all day well I just need to put those thoughts aside and focus on the children. Their safety is the most important thing. And it's not just because a lawsuit would bankrupt us right now. That casino mission would be good experience for them, but it's too risky. What if I let them go and the worst happens? <sighs> need to focus. Only one unfathomable fear at a time, Forsyth. If Hollis associated risk with something more positive than death, it would open her up to so many more missions. I mean, life experiences. Give me your wisdom, Nugget. <laughs> okay. So... We're going to do... So money and stress. So what if we went stress to risk? I definitely could not handle that stressful casino mission right now. And then risk with the life? Undertake risks. But what use is it? 
and then mushrooms. Mushrooms really do add a savory heft to any dish. If Hollis wants to solve her money problems, she's gonna need to accept some risk. Yeah, I, I know. I'm trying to collect shit. So mushrooms and money. I wonder if any of the mushrooms in the forest nearby are rare and valuable. Uh, so then we're going to associate this with Stop thinking about money so much. It is the root of all evil after all. Hmm. That's not the change I was going for. It's the one I was going for. Believe some people prefer open casket funerals. Disgusting. I just want to see what the dialogue is. Wear socks with sandals. Worry about rattlesnake bites. Interesting, but that's not going to help us go on the casino. I just wanted to see. Wait, do they have dialogue for this? Die than wear socks with sandals. Okay. I just, I had to know. Now I'm gonna leave that as it is. Who am I kidding? If I wasn't worried about something, I wouldn't be me. It just means I care. Okay, so if we take money... And then combine it with delight. I never say this out loud, but the truth is, I really, really, really just love money. Okay, so we do that, and then we take stress, and then we put it with. Risk? I definitely could not handle that Okay, no, that's I've right already now. done that. So if we do risk and then the light undertake risks. But what use is it? I think the only way to get Hollis to take us on a mission to a casino is to oh, ever okay. associate risk with money. Yeah, that makes sense. I think... I think I just figured out how to solve all our money problems. Yeah, whoops. You caused a brainstorm, I'm guessing? Um... The fuck? The fuck was that? Hey, Teach? What gives? I was in the middle of a sweet hookup there. Guess what, kids? You all did so well on your lesson. How about we give your new power a test drive out in the field? You mean we're going on the mission? For real? Isn't that dangerous? You know what they say, Sam. Nothing ventured, nothing brained. I don't think that's what... Let's roll. Heck yes! Cool. All right. Sweet. Um... Woo! We just got all these kids killed. I'm so glad you changed your mind about the mission, Agent Forsythe. I was nervous about bringing the children, but if you feel that it's safe, then it must be. It's crucial we find out what these delusionists are up to at the casino. With you handling tactical command, I'd say our probability of mission success has risen 35%. 
I'll take those odds. Now, how long till we reach the Lady Lactopus? We are almost there, Agent Forsythe. How are you feeling? <laughs> Lucky. Well, we're here. Oh dear, we just ruined a person. A high roller suite to use as our base of operations. Now, children, you are not to leave the suite. Like most casinos, the Lady Lactopus has a strict no psychics policy. Aww. Weak. Be happy for this chance to observe Agent Forsyth in action. Teacup, this is Shoehorn. We are nearing position one. I'm moving down the primary ventilation shaft, and Dustpan is approaching the front desk. I. Teacup, okay. Come in. Are you there? Hollis. Hmm? Oh, yes. Shoehorn, this is Teacup. I have you on visual. Teacup, this is Daspan. I'm approaching position one. After you've disabled the side detectors and inhibitors, on your go-ahead, I'll approach the reception desk and distract the clerks. After they're distracted, I'll drop into the office and find the room number that belongs to this key. Just make sure to disable the main fan, because my position is close. No need to explain, agents. You do your job, and I'll do mine. Let's keep radio silent so I can concentrate. Understood. Roger that, Teacup. Dustpan out. Yeah, we're fucked. <gasps> Rasputin, don't sneak up on me like that. Listen, do me a favor and run up to the jet, will you? I need my dowsing goggles. I left them on my seat, I think. You wanted to be on a mission. Now here's your first objective. Fetch my dowsing goggles. Okay, but hurry. Our window of opportunity is closing. All right, I'll be right back. All right, I'm going to leave these. I'm going to try to make these slightly shorter episodes, so I'm not recording an hour for each one. Uh, so we'll see what happens next time. Have a nice night, everybody. I'll see you.